myself on that couch, Sheridan. Oh, lovely. Come on. How are you, Flower? I'm all right. Yeah, good. How are you? How am I going to interview you when I delivered your baby? Because <laughs> <laughs> we work together, you say, on a sitcom called Eyes Down. Did anyone ever say it? That was enthusiastic. <laughs> As I said, ever see that road accident? How are you? I'm all right. Yeah, yeah. Good. Who's this little fella? This is Barry. He's Barry. Look at the camera. Look. Can you see him? Let's have a look debut. at him. Can have a look, Barry. Yeah. Come here, Baz. Let's see him. Oh, he's gorgeous. Ooh. Come here, fella. Oh, Barry. Yeah. Oh, look at him. He's oh, he's lovely. Joy, look. Aren't you? Do you want to go back to your mum? You're panicking a bit. Go on then. Oh, on, I've, I've always wanted a pug. He's Sheridan. beautiful. Yeah. How many dogs have you got now? Four. Uh, good for you, good. What are they called? Uh, one's Lily Savage, after you. <laughs> My boxer, because I got her while I was filming Eyes Down. I remember Lily, yeah. Yeah, she... Lily, Enid. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Why she, Enid? Well, she's got a blue tongue and I thought Enid blue tongue, Enid blighter. Oh, right, okay. It was, it's <laughs> no, it's weak, it's lame, I'm sorry. No, go on. Enid, Trish, and little Baz. Oh, is he the only boy? Yeah. He's lovely. He yeah, is. and he rules the roost. Oh, as well. doesn't he? Baddy, Baddy. Oh, <laughs> <Hell>, fella. <laughs> Listen, well done on Little Shop of Others. Because oh, I've you. seen this show. You see, I saw it at the, the chocolate factory before yeah. you transferred. You're cracking in it, you know. Oh, I Were know. people surprised when they came to sit? Did they? Re did people realise you could sing? Uh, I don't know. Maybe they're just shocked, like covering their ears. Woman. Oh, get out of this. Stop. No, no. I, it, there's been people who've been really nice about yeah. it. I kind of sung with my mum and dad when I was um, growing up. So, I, but I've never had the training. So. I haven't, I didn't, you have, didn't you go to drama school or anything? No, no. Oh, I'm a blagger. You? Totally blagging it. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's. Uh, I love that because you know you get a lot of them. Go. Oh, I did four years at so and so, so and so, and no. you never. No, I didn't. You just got up there, girl, and showed them how it's done. I tried to. Yeah. yeah no, yeah. you're cracking in this. Is it, is oh, it doing well? You. It's doing really well. Yeah. yeah. Now we've moved to the West End. You know, the theatre's a lot bigger than the place you saw it in. Yeah. It's, uh, 700 now instead of 150 so and is it moving great. from there to another theater moving again yeah to the uh, new ambassadors theater in haven't July. you paid your rents or something why are they moving <laughs> <laughs> you shifting shit? us on well it's a smaller theater and yeah. they're changing the set and yeah. stuff so we're kind of just hopping from theater to theater but it's good it keeps it fresh yeah now nah, go and say it seriously go and say it's a crack i know because i love audrey because she's obviously inspired by all them b-movie mm. heroines yeah yeah which are great i had to look, watch a lot of those films for the you know to get the kind of idea of those 50s 50 yeah. style women, it was great. They are the Triffids we watched, all those kind of, <laughs> and all the Audrey Hepburn films and stuff like Have that. Have you always wanted to play it? Yeah. Yeah. It was weird because I was saying to um, look, a friend of mine, we were talking about what's our dream role to play in the show. And I'd said, oh God, I'd love to play Audrey because I grew up watching the film. And like a week later, my agent called and said, they're auditioning for Little Shop of Horrors and they want to see you for Audrey. I was like, oh, oh my God, I have to get it, I have to get it. Didn't think for a second that I would. And then, and then they she is. A leading lady in. in the West End. <laughs> yeah, and the like plant's it. cracking. The plant's it's amazing. The plant must have cost a fortune. Yeah, they did. They spent 100 grand on uh, redesigning it. It's very phallic looking. Uh, Can I say that? <laughs> 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 I'm allowed to say that on daytime channel. But yeah, yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's kind of very different. No, it's, you know, it's sort of like, you know. <laughs> You know. It's a big thing, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yes, yeah. yeah. And it, it grows as the show goes <laughs> on. If you're in the front row, you get tentacles around your ankles and you're yeah. dragged off your chair and, not, and eaten. And you've made Ralph Little jealous, Spirit's telling me. Why? Well, yeah, well, I have to snog Paul Keaton, who plays Seymour. I have to snog him every night. He's a great kisser, by the way. But, um, <laughs> but, uh, but that's, like, my favourite bit of the show. And, uh, but Ralph's been, like, a little bit jealous, you know, because I've been his girlfriend now for six years or something, and I'm cheating on him now with a new man. <laughs> Do you ever get nervous when you go on? Oh, God, yeah. You're joking, oh, really? I, yeah, every night. I get, I'm terrified now. I'm like this. Why are you nervous? Yeah, I just, Stop, I but, you know me. I know, what am I, I going to do? I know, I know, but it's all these people. Oh. <laughs> but you get it every night. <laughs> I know, I know. I've never got over that. I think nerves are good in a way, especially when you're going out to do a show. It yeah. kind of gives you that nervous energy to... Because in Ice Down, you never got nervous before you went on. Oh, I did. I just covered it well in front of you. It's like, I'm hard. Come on. <laughs> she, well, I'd be the nervous one, and she'd be sat there in makeup, like, not bothered. I mean, you used to amaze me. Look at her. She's cool as a cucumber. You and Edna. <laughs> Rock hard, the pair of you. She was. She was. Are you doing any more uh, two pints of lager and a pack of crisps? They're all about doing um, the last ever series in November, if they can get everyone back together, which is... I mean, I know, I don't want it to be the last one. Everyone, they keep, they keep saying this is the last one and then we do another three series. So um, it might not be the last, but they want to do one definitely in November. So. It's really successful, that, you know, isn't it? I mean... Oh, it's so much fun to do. We're like, it, honestly, it's just like having a laugh with your mates, you know. It's like, we're like family on that now, so yeah. it's such a laugh to do. Well, Will Mellow was saying that. He said it's not well, like... Well, he was on the other yeah, day, wasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he said yeah, they yeah. go in, you have a hoop, don't you? It is so much fun. 
Should we have a look? Should we have a clip? Bert, put it on. Shove it on. And who's got the best of good cheesy wheezy kneesies? Corinthian hands. <laughs> Janet, exactly where on the body are the cheesy wheezy kneesies located? <laughs> Johnny, as you well know, it is a medical fact that the cheesy wheezy kneesies are located between the thighsy wisey piesies <laughs> and the shinny winny Albert Finneys. I wish you could hear yourself. Baby talk sounds so stupid. Doesn't it look a bit Yes, it does. Yes, it does. See, it's catching. Oh, thank you. Oh, God. Ah, oh. sorry about this. Uh, I've just taken a swig of this, well, laughingly called tea. I think the drag description's acted up. So look at the colour of that. It's like an emir in a cup. I mean, oh, that's disgusting. Listen, how's your mum and dad? They're wicked, yeah, yeah. yeah. They'll be watching, are you? Yeah, they'll be watching up north. Yeah, the... They gave you the performing book, didn't they? Yeah, I sung with them from when I was about four. They're a country and western duo. And, um, yeah, so I kind of grew up with country music. and But the, I, I owe them for my singing, really, yeah. yeah. Are you still a big country western fan? Yeah, massive. Yeah. I, I, it was horrible at school because I used to get a bit bullied because it wasn't very cool to have <laughs> parents that do that. But now I think it's wicked. I love it. Did you see Dolly Parton when she was over? She was amazing. <laughs> Honestly, I went to watch her at Wembley and she played every instrument going, all of them covered in rhinestones. <laughs> She's fabulous. I love her. I love her. I've got something here. Oh, though. no! <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe you go out and these. <laughs> No, but the story is, I have, I have karaoke parties at my house. I've got, like, the PA system, karaoke books a lot. And you have to go fancy dress, stars in your eyes. And I always go with Dolly Parton, and they're my boo. How oh, much do the neighbours say with oh, you? They hate me, of course. <laughs> but the more drunk I get, they get lower and lower. <laughs> <laughs> By the end of the night, I'm like, what? Well, boobs by my knees. I mean, they're, they're, pretty, um, they're pretty realistic, aren't they? <laughs> they look like they've got stretch marks where I've been battering them. <laughs> <laughs> I think they'd be like, am I wasting all of us at the karaoke? <laughs> Jaden, it's great to see oh, you. Thank you for I know you're rushing me. off to the theatre. Yes. The theatre after this. Yeah. You're taking the little fellow with you. Yeah, well. Because I'll mind him otherwise. You never get him back, but I'll mind him. <laughs> yeah. So listen, it's lovely. Ladies thank and gentlemen, you. please put your hands together. Sheridan Smith, come on. Come on. Hey, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> what was it? What's she like? <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget, in today's 